guys, I'm Layla. Welcome to Raid Lore Stories. Today's lore story is going to be for Underpriest Abrogni. At the time of this recording, he is the 10X that everybody is after. So we thought it was very fitting to read his new in-game lore story, and I hope you guys enjoy. As the dwarven holdouts of Gloomdeep hold and the Sky Iron Dominion recovered following the Under Empire's destruction, they began a race to the bottom. Both settlements dug deep into the earth to discover new materials, which they traded. Most prospectors chose to reopen the tunnels that were closed to slow the demon spawn invasion of their realm many years before, hoping that these ancient passageways contained untapped veins of wealth. In their grand search, they discovered long-lost archives of dwarven lore, grand rune libraries that had been either abandoned or overrun by Serot's legions. When word of these discoveries reached the rune keepers of Gloomdeep Hold, several search parties were dispatched to bring back the troves of ancient knowledge. Few rune keepers were as wise and revered as Brogni, although his journey to recover the lost artifacts would change him forever. In his expedition, Brogni led a number of rune keepers carefully through the passages that once swarmed the life of his ancestors. Eventually, they reached a perfectly preserved archive, one that the rune keepers of the time had barricaded to protect it from Siroth's forces. Brogni left his subordinates to begin the laborious cataloging while he ventured deeper into the catacomb. As he wandered, he noticed an inviting green light emanating from deeper within, accompanied by a soft and sorrowful trill. Mesmerized, he delved deeper, abandoning his team. Finally, Brogni arrived in a primeval cavern, its walls aglow with glittering emerald, a gargantuan crystal at its heart. Its body thumped with light, and the keening that had ensnared Brogni's mind seemed to originate from this vast mineral. Sitting before this weeping gem and listening to it lament, he stretched out a hand to calm it. When Brogni withdrew his hand, centuries had passed around him. His skin had turned a pallid gray, while his mind raced with the wailing song of the earth. He witnessed a doom that awaited for the dwarves, should they continue their path. He had to tell his people what he had heard. Taking some fragments of the grand crystal of proof of his quest, Brogni ventured back up to the surface. Obsessed with what he had learned from the crystal song, he would become known as the Underpriest, an ancient cleric who preached of the scourge of the crystals and Teleria's lament. While he is bizarre to some dwarves, many have sought the wisdom of this ancient, sallow-faced man who decries the dwarves' renewed expansion, for they would bring upon themselves a greater fall than their collapse at the hands of Seroth's invasions. Guys, I really like this story. I think it's pretty good. It's, it's very similar to his original story, so I like they kind of didn't change it too much, and I think it serves Under Priest Brogni very well. Drop me some comments down below of what you think of this lore story, and thank you so much for watching.